construction work sites pose many safety risks, but four hazards are responsible for the majority of fatal accidents at those sites. Stick around, I'll tell you about the fatal four and how to avoid them. Hello, I'm Dan Clark of the Safety Brief. This is where we talk about health and safety hazards in today's demanding industrial and construction work sites, a service of Creative Safety Supply. Save 10% off your entire order at creativesafetysupply.com with coupon code SAFETYBRIEF. One word, safety brief. What are the fatal four? OSHA's most recent stats say that these categories of accidents make up a majority of the fatalities at construction sites. Caught in between accidents cause 2.5% of the fatalities at construction sites, electrocutions almost 9%, struck by an object at over 10%, and falls are responsible for a whopping 37% of fatalities. What can workers and workplaces do to avoid these? The worst first. Number one, falls. Employers install guardrails, cover holes, use warning lines with flags. Workers, wear your personal fall arrest system if it's required. Number two, struck by object. This category includes flying objects, falling objects, and being struck by vehicles. Employers have a plan for your vehicle safety on your site that includes backup alarms and hand signals. Make sure competent people check that loads are stable, especially when you're lifting loads with a crane. Workers, when working at heights, don't leave tools sitting out. Wear a hard hat. Wear the bright yellow and orange vest if you're given one. Be aware of vehicles and large objects around you. Number three, electrocutions. Employers have a lockout tagout program. Have somebody check electrical equipment on a regular basis to make sure it's set up properly and not damaged. Workers, observe and respect lockout tagout. Be careful when using extension cords and don't remove the ground pin from a plug. Also, be careful during wet conditions and stay at least 10 feet away from overhead power lines. Number four, caught in between. This includes being caught by large machinery such as cranes, machines with moving parts, and trenches. Employers, again, have a vehicle safety plan. Make sure that pedestrians stay out of a crane's swing radius. Put machine guards on all machines with dangerous moving parts and stabilize the areas around trenches and excavations to prevent cave-ins. Workers, Follow protocols using tools and machinery. When in doubt, assume a driver or crane operator can't see you and stay out of the way. That's it for this episode on Avoid the Fatal Four. Come back for more ways to stay safety compliant in today's ever-changing landscape of safety requirements. I'm Dan Clark of The Safety Brief, a service of Creative Safety Supply. Save 10% on your entire order at creativesafetysupply.com with coupon code SAFETYBRIEF. No spaces. SAFETYBRIEF.